I'm gonna leave now. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Excuse me. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna be reviewing the new Dose of Colors Frankation Palette. Okay, so here's the palette. It's really pretty, it's shiny and shimmery. Um, looks good quality. And it should be because I paid $55 for this palette, which is a lot for a palette in my opinion. But um, I've heard really good things about it. I've never ordered anything from Dose of Colors. I've heard they had really good um, liquid lipsticks and regular lipsticks. I heard they had great formulas. I've heard a lot of good things about the brand in general. And I've wanted to try some things, but now when they came out with this palette, I was like, okay, this is a good starting point for me. I'm gonna try it. Um, it came with a little postcard with Desi and Katie on the postcard with a cute little message. And then it came with some little stickers too, which are cute. Um, it has a Dosal Color sticker, a bottle of Don Julio, uh, some like a lip, a uh, pair of lips, and then a picture of the girls and flying money. So that's really cute. I saw a lot of videos of people reviewing the palette, but everybody was doing like a green look. I feel like every all the videos that I've seen were people doing, I don't know, something with the green shade in the palette. But I'm gonna do something with the blue. I do like the image of the girls. Desi and Katie, they have like a blue nighttime smoky kind of eye. I wanna do something inspired by that. So let's see. I don't know, here it goes. I partially did my makeup. I have on a little bit of foundation and brows. And then I'm gonna go back after I do the eyeshadow and touch up wherever it needs to be touched up, add concealer, all those kind of things. So I'm just gonna put a little bit of concealer on my eyelids. Put a little bit of the concealer under the eye too. Now all the names are on the back of the palette. I am really like, I don't know. I'm not good with figuring out what name goes to which shadow. I guess it's right under it, so I'm gonna assume that the brown color that I'm gonna go in with first is, let's see, it's true. I'm gonna set the concealer on my eyelids. I'm gonna go in with a little bit lighter of a shade first. I think it's necessary. That's the name of the shade, necessary. So now that we have that one, I'm gonna go in with, I believe this is the shade Churro. This will be our first base color. So I wanna use the blue, the blue um, shimmer shadow in the palette. So what I'm gonna do first is put down a black base because whatever the shadow looks like is gonna just intensify a little bit more. So far, I think these shadows are pretty intense, but it'll give it something to stick to since it's a shimmer shade and it'll help it stand out more. I'm gonna do one, at a, one eye at a time because I don't know how fast that uh, black base is gonna dry and I don't want it to dry before the shadow has time to stick to it. So now I'm gonna take this blue shade on my finger and put it right on top. Ooh, that's pretty. So far, I mean, I got a little fall down, but I'm also touching that part. My finger is also touching that lower part, but so far I don't have much fallout. It's just a little bit. If I were to use a blue base, I bet you it would've pulled even more of the blue, because right now I feel like I can see the blue sheen. But if I would've had a blue base, it might've made it even more intense. I'm gonna go on my pinky finger and I'm gonna take a little bit of the purple shade a moment. I'm just gonna put that on the end. I'm bring it in the middle a little bit. Oh, that, I wonder if that's the shade that she would, that they use, because even though it looks purple, it's coming out like blue. Okay, I'm just gonna put that over top of the whole thing. <gasps> that's gorgeous. Now that's what I was trying to do. I, sh I guess I should've swatched them before I started. Oh, that looks so pretty. So I guess this is like a for real first impression because I didn't know that was gonna happen. It really, to me, it looks purple. I guess it's one of those blues that look purple but are blue, if that makes sense. Cause to me, sometimes royal blue could look purple. So maybe that's what it is. And I don't even really like purple. I don't, not really, I don't like purple. But I'm so happy, oh, this is so cute. It's so, I just wanna keep like layering it. It's just so pretty to me. This eyeshadow alone might have been worth the whole palette. I mean, it's every all the colors seem pretty good. I had, like I said, I really didn't swatch. This is really a true first impression, but it's so beautiful. So here's the makeup done, guys. This is the finished look, and I'm in love with it. I really, really am. Like I said, 
this, the last shadow that I put on a moment, it looks purple in the palette, but it's clearly blue. I mean, I don't know what it's looking like. When I look back at the footage, I'll be able to see, but it's so intense and so beautiful. And it's really pretty layered over the black base that I put on there. And I know I layered the, um, oh, that's game over? Game over was the first color I used to put it, put it on top of, because I thought that was really the blue shade. But anyway, I'm really, really happy with how this look came out. And I actually have an event coming up, and I'm gonna do this exact makeup for the event because I wanna wear it every day. But I would definitely recommend this palette just based off of that blue color alone. A moment, I wish they sold it in singles because now if I run out of a moment, I feel like I wanna have a backup of it. If Desi and Katie happen to come across this video, make this palette in singles too because that one color is, is everything. It really is everything. I'm excited to try this other shade though. They have like a rosy gold shade in here. I wanna do some neutral, just like brown looks. And it has the matte shadow, so it'll be good for every day as well. This is a really nice, versatile palette, I have to say. Just doing this is the first time I used it, so this is the first look I ever did with it. But I really feel like this is a good palette to have. If you're in the micro new palette, this is a great palette to invest in. It's $55, but I really feel like you'll be able to do so many things with it. That one eyeshadow alone. This, a moment, that's what I have to say. Like, I just feel like, just look at it. I hope that you guys feel the same way that I feel because I'm super, super excited. This is so cute. I don't know, you guys let me know in the comments what you think. I mean, do you have it already? Do you wanna try it? Did this look do anything for you? And it was so easy, that was so easy. You could do that. Okay guys, that's the Dose of Colors. Desi and Katie round two Francasia palette. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to rate this video. Give me a thumbs up if you really liked it. Comment down below, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Do not forget to subscribe. Follow me on Instagram, parkav.co. I'll link everything you need to know down below. Check it out and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.